I was diagnosed with cancer in 1992. I was 44 years old and my children uh, were 16, 15, and 11 at that time. Um, I didn't, I've always been an extremely healthy person and I joke with Dr. Gluck now that I'm still a healthy person except for the cancer. Sandy and I first met each other back in 1992, so we've been on this road together for a while. Uh, and upon recurrence in the early 2000s, uh, uh, she benefited from many therapies uh, for, for multiple years. In 2003, uh, I was diagnosed with a recurrence, and that recurrence was in both my lungs, multiple tumors, three tumors in my liver, and five bone sites. So I was, I think, 55 at the time and never thought I would see 60. We just kind of wended our way through all the traditional chemotherapies. Side effects were pretty serious frequently. Um, and in 2007, I had finished them all. There was um, nothing else for me to do. But Dr. Cluck never said that. He told me that um, there were still more treatments available. Uh, Sandy is an excellent example of a, of a very youthful patient with a, a quest for life that uh, when we reached a point where we had exhausted standard therapies that uh, I told her it was worth uh, obtaining additional tissue, uh, submitting that for molecular profiling and that turned out to be fairly bountiful in terms of the information. So it was, it was a, an astonishing thought. I had some kind of disbelief because it sounded so good, um, but like I said, I was game to try anything. It allowed us to go in paths that we would not have anticipated. It has allowed her to take on therapies that would not otherwise have been offered and uh, we are now several years into this saga uh, where she has shown a, a great response to the therapies so predicted by molecular profiling. So to me, even though stage four metastatic cancer is not curable, it, as Dr. Gluck loves to say, it's treatable and manageable. Um, we know that the, the, uh, ca the cancer in the bone is progressing, but I still can do anything I want to do. And that's part of my joy is since 2007, um, I have seen both my sons married and I have had the birth of a grandchild and my daughter has graduated from nursing school. So those gifts are gifts 